Hello guys and welcome to the video this is Lyagora's Moments and today we're gonna try to fly the DJI Telo drone with a new application that I have here, the Telo Me app. The Telomi app can actively track a face or a person and follow you automatically. This is something that the original application didn't have. They had very nice modes, but this was missing there. So this application comes just for that, for tracking yourself, a face or a person and follow it automatically and it's amazing. How it works is the application analyzes the drone's live video feed and applies computer vision technology to track a face or a body. And there are different modes like follow, orbit or spotlight that we're gonna see later. When you download the application you get the demo version first to test the compatibility with your phone before purchasing. This is because the real-time analysis on the application requires actually a recent phone, a good and quick phone so this is good that it gives you the opportunity to check it first before buying it. The demo that you will download will have many restrictions. First, you will not be able to record a video. Second, you will not be able to screen record your phone with any other application like DU Recorder. I tried it out, it's not working. And third, you have three days of testing period. You can remove the restrictions if you decide purchasing the full version as in-app purchase and it will cost you around 5 euro. But before that, you need to make a performance test of your phone to see if it's compatible. And this will happen automatically when you first connect your phone. And if the test fail, you won't be able to purchase the full version. As most probably your phone is not strong enough to handle the application. And there is nothing that you can do about it, just getting a better phone. So let me take you outside to show you how it works. So we came outside to check the Telomi app. Okay, let's do it. So I'm going to click record and let's see, I'm going to put the drone up, 3, 2, 1, yes, take off. We have similar controllers here like that. Okay, now I'm going to try some. Uh, here, what they have to do, well, some tracking modes here. So, most prominent face, okay. It's me, go. So, this now it's tracking my face. You're gonna follow me. I'm not doing anything, and it's following my face. I'm turning, it's tracking my face automatically. And it's following me if I'm going backwards, if I'm going on it, it's gonna go back. So it keeps distance on me. <laughs> nice. Cool, yeah? That's nice, by the way. Okay, so let's stop that. I'm gonna track another one. Let's track. I'm gonna turn here. Opa. Have to turn actually the thing. Let's turn it. And now we're gonna track selected person. You can select most prominent person. I'm gonna select select person. Okay, I'm gonna click. You, you see, it's already tracking me and Christina here. You can see. <laughs> Look. And I'm gonna select you and go. So wherever you're gonna move, now it's gonna follow you. You can go. <laughs> so it's dragging Christina. Oh, it lost you. Go back. Okay, I can move it down. We can track. 
I can select now most prominent person. Okay, go. It's gonna be Christine again. You can move. Move on the drone. Bravo. It's gonna go back. Now go behind again because it's gonna crash. <laughs> yeah. Oh, sometimes it's losing. Tr it, now it's following me. It, it confused itself. <laughs> I steal. I steal your truck. I steal your drone. Just like that. Okay, let's stop. Because I select just the most prominent person, so if I select person, okay, I'm gonna select. I'm gonna select you again. Go. Now it should it should follow only you. So move right, left. Yeah, it's following you. It's following you exactly. So what if I go also here on the side? It's gonna no, 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 no. This time it's not confusing. I'm just passing. And it's not confusing when I pass in front of you. Oh, I steal it. Okay, sometimes it's confusing. Now it's following me. <laughs> okay. But anyway, sometimes it's confusing like that. That's good. What is orbit? I'm going to click orbit. So when you click orbit, it's just going a bit on the right. Yeah, and it's following you, same, but going a bit on the right. That's nice. You can select on the left as well. If you click spotlight, anything happen? I just not following you. With the spotlight, it's not following you. It's just staying in the same uh, spot. In order for you to follow you, you're going to, need to click follow, and now it's gonna come most probably. Yeah, it's coming slowly. Are you gonna go back? If I'm gonna go close to it, or gonna follow me back here? Oh, it's still tracking me, eh? It's gonna come to me because it's following me now. And let's run to see what's gonna happen. It's following me. <laughs> yeah, it's following me, kind of. It's tracking good, not bad. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, you steal my tracking. Now it's tracking you. You can move. <laughs> That's nice. So that was the features here on the track. We can also select group of person to track group of person. So that us actually. So how we can now nah, can select both of us here. We select both of us. Now like this how it's going. It was like both before. Now it's select only me. Let's go closer. Ah, now we are both. We are both. Click go. So where we move now, it's gonna follow us. Should be. The tracking green box became bigger here on the application and following both of us. Both of us. What if we're gonna split? You go there, I'm going there. The green box becoming bigger. But the drone don't know what to do, <laughs> and it lo lost us. We should be near. Okay. And landing. Landing. Okay. So right now we're tracking Christina playing basketball. It's on follow mode. Try to go to the other basket after. Oh, it came too near. <laughs> See that? <laughs> it's not so near. And it's following now. It's following you. Nice. Now I should go back and it lost track. It lost track of you. Okay, sometimes it's losing track. As you saw, the active track can be lost very easy. If there are many persons and the drone might follow someone else. Like here, for example, it just follow a total stranger. 
Also keep always your eyes on the drone, just in case there is any obstacles, as this tracking mode will not give new obstacle avoiding sensors to your drone, right? The drone will follow and track you blindly without tracking any other obstacles on the way. So if you use orbit or follow, make sure to check the path of the drone constantly. Additionally, the drone will inform you like the original app about the low battery. Depends on what percentage you put it and it will land automatically when battery is very low. From my experience, I would say land it immediately when it drops 20% if you don't want to lose your drone. Oh no! And let me know in the comment section below what you think about the application. I believe it's a good additional application to have. Of course, it's not working perfectly all the time, but it's nice when you do some sports or something and you want the drone to track you and follow you. It's amazing, actually. So, guys, that's the video. And until next time, let's make moments we can never forget.